Hello everyone. To this video, I'm going to talk about AEM 6.4 for science session. I'll be creating a sample and testing it. Okay, now let us start the demo. I have logged into the AEM 6.4. I'll go to personal session. So to test personal session, I need to create an audience first. So let me go to the audiences. So I have global, V retail, and weekend site listed. I'll be working on the V retail section. So to create an audience, we need to have a context hub. So I'll go and create a context hub segment. I'll be creating a male and a female sample versions. So I have given a title as my male sample. The boost I'll leave it as it is. So I'll create it. Okay, the success message is right. As you can see, the segment is listed here now. So I'll go and edit it now. So these segments are used to test some condition. So as you see the left side, we have a set of properties listed. So I'll add one of those components here. This says comparing property null. So I am going to configure that thing. As you see, the segment is ready now. I have added a comparing property, profile or gender equals male, which means the for male candidate, this segment will get satisfied. So let us test it. So I'll go to person now. I'll select a female version. You can see the message data loaded in context of do not resolve the current segment. So now let me go and select a male candidate. Okay, now it became gray. As you see, data load in the context of this all the current segment. So this main version segment is created. To test personalization, I need multiple conditions or segments. So let me create another one. I'll repeat the similar process here. Now I will test the segment, selecting a female candidate, you can see the segment gets resolved. 
let me change it to email. Now it says data load in the context of do not resolve to the current pipeline. Now we have created the audiences. Next step is creating brands. Let us go to the brand section. I'll go to activities. We can see two brands already created. So I'll go ahead and create a new brand. I'll select the default template. I'll leave the tag section as it is. You can see the sample brand is listed here. Since no activity is added with this brand, you can see the brand listing is zero. Through this video, let us see how an offer can be created and test it for presentation. I'll go to presentation, offers. You can see a sample brand which was created previously. So I'll go for creating an offer. So I'm going to create an offer, so I'll select the template for offer page. I'll name it as mail. I'll leave the tag section as it is. Click on create. So this will open the page once created. As you see, we have a basic template here. So I'm going to order this for a mail. Sorry, I need to create As you can see, there are some basic properties here. So we have the made offer page. Let me create a new email offer page. The same way. Set it as email, create, open the page. This time I'll author a text from the group. Image component helps us to test the offers. So let me add a female image here. Now you can see just the basic properties. It's a female offer, which is a text component, and there is an image component. Let me go back to my English page. Okay, now the V-retail English page is open. I'm going to author an image. Okay, in edit mode, I have added the image. So let me go for the targeting. This time I'm going to test the targeting for offers. So you can see the sample brand here and select that. 
can add created test activity. Just confirm whether I have created for this apple friend. So next come back to start targeting. Let me select the targeting component. I'll just enable the targeting for the component. So I have my main sample. So this time I need to remove any previous offers. Okay, now my component is clear. I'm going to add an offer here. So as you see, the female sample is selected. Let me select the offer from the offer library for female. I'll go for male sample, add an offer. Choose the offer from the library. Click on next. You can see the targets listed here. Save it. Go to preview mode. Let us test this targeting now. So as you see for the anonymous user or administrator, I have the default image. Let me go for a female. Awesome. You can see the text component which I had out there with the image. Offer is appearing here. Let me go back to the main handle. Awesome. So the offer component is appearing here. So this is the way we just a personalization for the offers section. If you have any queries, do let me know your thoughts through the comment section. Thanks for watching this video.